can tell too because there'll be fingerprints in it. Yes, you do. Hell, they go to our living laboratory. Some of the scientists are throwing their kids out into the sand. The U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative ways to produce beautiful harvests now and into the future. Vanilla. Java apple? Cinnamon? The yeah. tropics are home to the great diversity tree? of plants. Cinnamon so comes on a tree? Interesting. I didn't know that. It's like on a tree? I guess it's a, it's a branch, yeah. That's okay, right. Branch. Yeah, it's well known around the world. Jackfruit. Edible water plants. Look at that's a jackfruit. Plants that have been an important source of nutrition for people living fruit. in the tropics. Many are rich in vitamins and minerals, while others are well adapted to growing in less than ideal conditions. Wow, that's a pineapple. Oh, Some, yeah, that's like the water bitter, thrive in wet, swampy areas and waterways. All parts of this plant, even the go. flower petals, are that's edible. Oh, look at that. The destruction of the plant has long been Those used ready. to make flour. Those are ready. Up there. One day, many of these lesser known tropical plants will be important as the bananas grow on both sides of the boat. A tail. More than 28 million tons of bananas are eaten annually, making it the most popular fruit in the world. Tour. Yep, that's true. Yeah, that's true. 
Thank you. That's one. Anybody else? Oh, we got one. More, more, more. The future of agriculture may include innovative ideas like this vertical growing system. Plants grown in this way use a fraction of the space required by traditional growing. Get these guys the that saves water in there? and increases production. The aquaponic system on your left combines hydroponics with aquaculture. The fish provide a natural source of fertilizer for the plant. It's Saturday, they're the all off. Help keep the water clean for the fish. It's another great way to produce more while using less. Get our lab. Yeah, yeah, next to the Next to the solar project. The goal of these efforts is scientists, hired farmers, and even backyard gardeners are doing their part to improve the quantity and quality of foods that.